सो हे व्हाट्सअप गाई दिस साइड आर आर एन यू वॉचिंग एट रिक्रिएटर्स यूट्यूब चैनल सो वी गैन सी द रिव्यू ऑफ लेटेस्ट पिक्सल एक्सपीरियंस प्लस एंड्रॉइड थर्टीन अपडेट ऑफ रेडमी नोट टेन आई नो इट्स बिग बट या सो वी गैन सी हाउ मच बेटर इन टर्म्स ऑफ परफॉर्मेंस एंड स्मूथनेस इज दिस रोम इज एंड यू नो दैट रेडमी नोट टेन इज माई फेवरेट डिवाइस फ्रॉम रेडमी फ्रॉम पास टू ईयर्स सो without wasting a further ado let's get started to the video and we can see that how much good it is so guys first of all i want to talk about the smoothness of this room and if you were seeing my videos and i already talked about that smoothness and performance does matters over any type of hardware so first of all if you can see that that i am using this room the opening closing animation of this room is so quite good even i just open any things like qa there is no lag in the qs panel also you can feel that it is working smoothly and i haven't faced any type of jitter lag any type of issues that you can get i am also using this room for with my primary geo sims and you can see that that i have used very much well you get that music pop up from here and this is all the notification that looks like here and there is a few updates had been given to this room so let me start from the set overall settings ui and look out what we are getting or not first of all i would like to start, talk about a network there is aren't any bug sort of any issues that i have faced so far i have been operating through my geo sims and if you ask me about the hotspot there is aren't issue of hotspot i if i just enable the what you say hotspot and it will not get automatically disabled so that is working fine all around no issues that i have faced so far in the applications we got in default apps an option with get the of oh, pixel launcher we know that pixel launcher doesn't provide any of sort of customizations at all so we going to see it we never going to see that in the notification option there is not a much more had been given because of pixel experience room in the battery option we get the abix battery usage i will talk about the battery usage in the later part of the video not this time in the sound and vibration this is a quick layout the settings where you are getting you can check that this is a normal settings present in every room apart from that in the display nothing new has been given if you talk about the aod here is the always show time and info and you can see that always show time and info is been working all around so you are not getting any issue sort of there also and no customizations option is been there because of his plus build you get another customizations as you know that it's pure android so we get a multiple theme palettes for this wallpaper if i just select this the whole upper ui gets changed and whoa, it looks so good you can enable theme icon or you know, disable it totally depends on you we going to up upgrade that you all know and apart from that uh we yeah we are getting security of face unlock fingerprint unlock both but i didn't use that things and in the system option you get the some of the customizations in terms of this room here you get the gestures option gesture navigation no customization in it and this always the normal settings i have just disabled the 100 mode my fingers are little big so i don't need that 100 mode option too and there is a pre given system update application but i don't recommend to use this because you need to flash it by own this rom can be flash over any ofox or twrp or you can just do this over atb siloed method no not as new any type of what do you say installation process is there and you can one thing you can do to this video that you can like this video if you really liked and subscribe to my channel if you really loved apart from that this is customization that all no status bar and everything i have i have talked about now talking about what i feel about this room and let me start from the benchmarks that we are getting in this room first of all i would like to start with the 3d benchmark application and now from the result section you can see that in the wildlife score it got a very best score of 481 in this room and in the slingshot extreme test it performs an average of 1455 with a max Fm FPS of fifty dot five zero, which is pretty good. And if I generally talk about what you say, many people ask me about the safety net. Yeah, the safety net does pass all around. You can see that safety net status does pass, so no issues you are getting in the safety net issues. Apart from that, let me talk about the device certification of the device. Yeah, the device is being certified, so you're not gonna see any of the certain kind of any issues in this room so far. apart from anything that i would like to share is 
about the cpu throttling and what the performance that we are expecting from this room yeah this is as a good cpu throttling graph you can see that it has been run for 15 minutes and the max is 142.8283 gips it has been throttled for 89 percent max performance and this is a pretty good score it is we know that pixel launcher does not sorry pixel experience does not have any kind of performance profile so you do not get any kind of this is some of my battery uses that i am talking right now you can see that sot of my device and what the apps have been used and now talking about what i recommend this room or not so i am going to recommend this room to all of you because if you can see that the smoothness uh, everything sort of uh, things where passes out and no lag stutter you can feel in this room everything even that you know, we gonna see no option of advanced restart because of the pixel experience and uh, you can use with the banking apps in this room but if you have lots of money in your bank account please don't use this because it does create a lot of issues with use so it is all about the room review and those who one were asking me about where the are we are getting l1 security level we are getting l1 security level with the netflix options too so don't take any kind of seriousness and that we are not getting this or that so far this were the some of the geekbench scores that i have found so far with the single core and multi core you can see this so you will not get any of the issues so guys this is all for the wrap up we will gonna see another in upcoming videos so thanks for watching the videos. Keep subscribing. Keep liking. Bye-bye.